All right, Paula. Well, I want to first take a look at the rainfall activity exactly where CAM is tonight. You can see those showers, uh, outer rain bands associated with East Cell continue to push through. And again, this is not only the Hilo side, but down into the southeast coast. We're talking about places like Pahoa, into Pahala, even down into Kau. And this is just the beginning. And it's not just your typical passing shower activity that's moving through. These outer rain bands have those gusty winds that CAM was talking about. That's also tucked in. So again, that is not only pushing in the showers, but it's pushing it pretty strongly. And it's only expected to uh, deteriorate through the next uh, several hours as we continue to count down as we expect ESL to make landfall. The shower activity we're seeing on the other islands, Maui County getting some of it associated with ESL, but Oahu, this, this is not associated with the moisture wrapped around uh, Hurricane ESL this afternoon. What's happening is some of that wind is kicking up the moisture from the Pacific. So that's what we're seeing on Oahu at this hour. It is not Isel making its move just yet up the island chain. Here's an update on where Isel is right now, 150 miles east southeast of Hilo. And again, uh, since the last advisory this afternoon at 2 o'clock, winds actually picked up a little bit. Winds sustained now at 80 miles an hour, but we are still anticipating once Isel does make a move into the Big Island to weaken down to possibly a strong tropical storm uh, with winds about 70, maybe a little stronger uh, by about 8 o'clock tonight and then continue to work its way through the Big Island. You can see just south of Maui about uh, late tonight into the early part of Friday morning and then continuing to push up the island chain a little further south of Oahu uh, early Friday morning. We're talking about 7, 8 o'clock, packing on winds of 65 miles an hour and then even further south south of Kauai by about tomorrow night with winds at 50 miles an hour and then it exits. Let's take a look at the breakdown here. Uh, the latest watch uh, warnings, I should say, tropical storm warning in effect for Kauai, Oahu and Maui County. The Big Island still the only area still under a hurricane warning this afternoon. Now, as we get further into coverage tonight, we're really going to see these conditions uh, deteriorate as Isel continues to make its way over the island of Hawaii. It's moving closer and closer, and we've been monitoring it. You know, the impacts will start to get really bad along the, especially the Hamakua coastline. You see this yellow coloring here associated with Isel. By the time it makes landfall later tonight, we're looking at winds at about 39 miles an hour by this afternoon, increasing uh, into this evening. Once this uh, orange coloring gets over there, we're looking at the possibility of uh, some 70 mile an hour winds. So, again, our weather team watching this.